That's me, top of the morning to go now. I'm officially a middle-aged man in, man in Lycra, a mammal. So, new kick day, big up TWR on my birthday. Yep, I'm on the fifth floor now. I decided to go for a solo ride, a long one. I've not, I've not done a long solo ride before. And this is kind of um, inspired by a friend goes by the name of the Iron Empress, the Iron Woman, AKA Donna. Um, where she spoke about on one of her Insta posts about doing a, a long solo ride. So um, it's all your fault, Donna, why I'm doing this. But um, yeah, she's a very inspiring lady, many accolades and achievements. And um, if I can do a fraction of what she's done on the bike, then pff, boy, I've done something. But yeah, so I'm gonna go on a solo bike ride today on my birthday and then see what happens for the rest of the day. But yeah, journey with me, as my Yardi familiar would say. Uh, this is Kamut doing this Kamut thing, look. You know, sometimes doing the same route over and over again can get boring, so. I'm doing a different loop via Bushy Hill Park, I think it's called. But, um, I mean, look at this. This feels more like a bloody gravel ride. You finished? Just went over um, a big pothole in the road. Couldn't avoid it. Just checking the tyres. Seem okay. We're about halfway there. I'm at Hampton Court at the moment. Feel right. Feel like I need to eat a snack bar or something. That would be a swig of my drink bar. Because the sun's out, got my puny guns out. Um, it's a little bit breezy. But yeah, so far, so good. I'm in uh, Sudbury on Thames. Normally when I come with the group, we go straight ahead. But this route is telling me to go down there. I've never done that way before, so. But I'm gonna go, because it's different. Like I said, I don't like doing the same route all the time. It gets boring. Ah, right.
we turn right at these lights right here. Again, this is a different way. and coffee done now for the return journey home it's a decent ride getting here met an old fella we got talking had a really good chat 70 i think he's 74 he said and he's been riding since 1983 and he said he's clocked up over 113,000 miles on his bikes um, he said he's got log, log books galore. So before there was Strava, there were log books. Recorded all of his rides on his log books. He's clocked above 130,000 miles. Crazy.
You know what amazes me, right? That um, motorists complain about cyclists on the road. And I get it, there are some cyclists that are not aware of their surroundings. They don't have like spatial awareness when they're riding. They don't know etiquette or the rules of cycling on the road. And then you get pedestrians, and sometimes, rightly so, have a moan at cyclists when um, they see cyclists on the pavement when they don't realize that um, quite a lot of the uh, pavements are actually shared pathways. They're meant to be shared between cyclists and pedestrians. But what really gets my goal is when you've got pedestrians that are walking in what is blatantly a cycle only path when right adjacent to it, you've got you know a pedestrian walkway like this for example so you've got the pedestrians on pedestrians on the left cycle path on the right but you've got pe pedestrians that are just blatantly just walking in the cycle path not caring the world and when you tell them it's a cycle only path they want to get aggy with you rant over <laughs> year and a half ago I came off the bike I fell off the bike turning that corner that I just um, came around and this is about it was midday it was dry um, I have no idea how or why I came off there was no oil spill or anything thankfully I just got a little bit of bruising to the side of my thigh um, but more importantly, I've, ever since that happened, I've been very cautious and wary of um, taking corners at speed. Now, I wasn't necessarily going too fast on that corner, but um, it's just made me very cautious and wary whenever I'm um, taking corners on the bike now. That corner is forever etched on my thigh and on my mind whenever I take corners. Did it, nearly home. 55 miles, solo ride, to celebrate my 50th birthday today. I'll see you all on the next ride.